Hey y'all, this is Gingenese, coach of the Texas Tornadus, here with week 7 of the PAC YouTube Draft League. This week we're taking on Sven and the Uppsala Umbreons. Uh, my opponent this week has a lot of setup threats like Como O, Azumarill, Cloyster, and a lot of bulk like Corviknight and Glowking. But let me show you the team that I'm going to bring. First off, as always, we have Deep Fried. Uh, this week we're Black Belt Blaziken. I didn't feel like I really needed the coverage, so we're bringing both Swords Dance and Protect, and Black Belt lets Close Combat do a ton of damage right off the bat. Tommy Chong, our Culberberry uh, Defensive Slowbro, with just Scald and Psychic. Blue Dream, our Yachi Berry Thunderous, so we have two Resist Berries this week. Uh, Yachi allows us to take an Ice Shard for Mamoswine. Mandibuzzed is back, our Boots Defog fully spit F Mandibuzz. Cashed, our Corsola with Haze for all those setup mons that I mentioned earlier. And finally, we've got Tapu Bolu uh, with the Eject Pack this week so that a close combat uh, can still give us some momentum. All right, uh, I'll cut until we get into the battle. All right, here we are for the battle against Finn. Uh, really kind of nervous for this one. Depends on what he brings. Uh, interesting. Okay, so we have Azu, Cloyster, Jolteon... Como, Mamo, and Glow King. Okay, so he did not bring the Corviknight, which I was really assuming. Um, the Shell Smash Cloister could be a problem. Uh, and what else? The I thought he was going to bring Umbreon. He brought Jolteon instead. Okay. Um, well, this is tough. Cause I was going to lead my thunder is but I'm not sure that that's a great answer right I'm still gonna do it because I was only going to switch well I don't actually I don't think I was gonna hard switch anything um hmm the cloister is a problem my slow bro is gonna have to kind of pull double duty with the mammo and the cloister now unfortunately but I think that my Corsola can actually take a Shell Smashed Cloister. So, uh, most of this game is going to be trying to figure out what sets my opponent is, what they have, what they brought, because Mamo could be Life Orb, Focus Sash, Choice Band. Uh, Azu could be Sap Zipper and probably is since they have Cloister. But let's see. Sanic, the Jolteon. Okay. So, Jolteon against my Thunderous, I mean, Hyper Voice does a lot, but do you go straight for Hyper Voice? If it's Specs, um, I, don't th I don't think you do. Uh, I really don't want to lose health on my Thunderous this early, but I'm just going to go straight for Psychic. Toxic? That's totally fine. Uh, I... Again, I only need health on this enough to really like do a couple big hits. So let's see how much damage we're doing here. Um, because it's toxic, we do just under 50. Yeah, so it looks like max speed, um, max HP probably. All right. Uh, so, you could just hard switch. Like, I don't really know what it, it might protect. I'm trying to think what the best move here would be. I kind of want to go Bulu, but I don't want to get Toxic. Like, not, nothing on my team really wants to take a Toxic. I'm going to Psychic again. Protect, yeah. I mean, that was that was obvious, but what do I do, right? I, I guess the the best move there would have been going into Blaziken, but my Blaziken can't touch Azu, so I'm not too worried about that. Here, I think you switch, right, or go for Toxic again. Um, this is not good. <laughs> uh. Do I want to predict the switch? No, I'm, I'm going to go for Psychic one more time. I, 
could have volt switched, but magic is that the the bro it is, or not the bro the the slow king. So how much am I doing with this psychic? According to my calc, I should be doing like twenty five percent, and that might be, yeah, that's about right. Okay, but I have a switch for this. My mandibuzz and. Thunderous still has enough HP that it can take an Ice Shard with the, the Yachi Berry from a Mammo if I have to. I did lose much more health on that than I wanted, but it is what it is. Sludge Bomb, how much is this doing? Well, about 48 uh, to my Mandibuzz. Okay, so it's not modest. Um... It's also not max special attack. Um, I would love to foul play here. I think I might just U-turn, and I'm, I'm going to. If you stay in, yeah, you didn't. Okay, cool. Good, good, good. Hi there. Eeg. All right, how much is my uh, Grass Knot doing from Thunderous to Azu? About 50%. At this point, that's what I'm, I'm, I need to do here, is get some damage on this Azu. I don't think it's going to let me Volt Switch. Volt Switch is so obvious. It's Leftovers, good to know. It's probably Sap Zipper. Uh, I need, 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 need damage on this thing. You could very easily just protect on this turn. I'm going to Grass Knot. I would love to Volt Switch, but I think that you switch here. Yeah. Into Magic. Okay. Uh, that's a good play. It's a really good play. I should have just Volt Switched. <laughs> um, how much am I doing with Dark Pulse? My Thunder is not enough, and I need this, so now I'm going to Volt Switch. You let me get it off, thank goodness. That does not do enough damage. Uh, I am in a, a bad spot here. I am not sure how I'm going to break this team. I mean, I'll go back into my Mandibuzz. Ice Beam. Good play. I can Roost. Or can I? That... That could be bad. That could be really bad. So I think you, you can just switch into whatever you want for free right now. Yeah, uh, probably the Jolteon. Blue Lagoon. Oh, that might just be game then. Um, so I have to go Corsola and hope that... Hold on, let me look at my calc. Is there any way that at plus two I live? I mean, I should. Yeah, Shell Smash. At plus two, I should live this, and I can... Uh, Let's see, if you're like Hydro Pump, because I don't know yet if it's physical or special. Either way, I can uh, I can Strength Tap here. Eat up a hit. Icicle Spear. I mean, if you're King's Rock, I don't know if King's Rock is... Bam Ooh, let's go. That's actually awesome. Um, this won't kill me. I don't know if King's Rock is banned in our league or not. <laughs> I hope so. If I get flinched here, I'm going to be mad. Okay. But we Strength Step. You're now at plus one instead. Uh, Icicle Spear is cursed. Uh, so I can go for Rocks. I think for free now. Shell Smash again? Oh no. 
I should still live this, actually. Looking at my couch. I think I still live. So I can haze now. Plus, I mean, you didn't... Hold on, if you're Hydro Pump... No, I should still live this. So I can haze. Because Thank goodness for that curse body. But I should still live. I can't imagine that I don't. Yeah, a modest 252 at plus. Yeah. I mean, good luck, man. <laughs> I, I like it. I really do. Make me show that I have haze. I appreciate it. It was a good play. Uh, at this point, we'll just Nightshade. I mean, that'll show off my entire set, but you can keep Shell Smashing as much as you want, man. Uh, I, I don't know what your end goal is here. Let's see how much damage this does. Yeah. Move is no longer disabled. So I'll strength sap again. I don't know. I feel like the correct move might be just to haze forever. Liquidation. Oh, go for a drop. Which you didn't get. Strength sap, you're at plus one. Okay, so this is... Liquidation. Uh, I will haze again. Because now at plus one, like, you're not doing anything. High school spear. This has, according to my calc, like an 8% chance to... Oh, goodness. Okay, well, so we got the curse body. Cool. Because... I think the Icicle Spear was the only way that you could two-hit KO. If Liquidation is your next strongest attack and you're at plus one, and after this, because I'm hazing, you won't even be at plus one. Um, this is an, an interesting back and forth. Cloyster does just straight up beat me. If I... Okay. So this will be plus one again, right? Because I'm strength sapping. Just trying to make sure that I'm always not in kill range. Okay, so we know that Icicle Spear is torched. You're at plus one right now, right? So if I Nightshade and you Shell Smash, Liquidation, I should be okay. I think I'm okay. Right, so this should only do... I mean, assuming you don't get the drop. Yeah, that's good. So I can Nightshade right now. And... Win, basically. Uh, well, win this, this interaction, at least. I wonder if I should Strength Sap one more time. Because I think you just attack me. So I'm going to Strength Sap one more time. Nice. Okay, this way we end with as much HP as we possibly can. Still no drops. That is wonderful. So it looks like we're going to end this interaction with close to full health, at least like 60. Okay, yeah, so if you Icicle Spear here, then I'll have about 60 HP, or 60%. I have rocks up now. I still don't know how I'm going to beat anything else uh, but Cloyster KO'd by uh, Corsola which that's obviously Corsola's first KO of the season Cloyster is scary man uh, I think Sven picked up Cloyster this week or last week so while I was looking at his team to prep and stuff and I'd just groaned when I saw that he picked it up because like, oh my goodness, another setup mon besides Azu and Komo already. 
All right. Um, so this could be, this could be whirlpool stuff. God, I'm in such a bad spot. I'm going to switch to my mandibuzz and try to get unfrozen because I'm not doing anything right now while I'm frozen, obviously. Uh, I think my Corsola still has some stuff. Okay, sub, not great. Uh, sub Azu. Sub leftovers Azu. Uh, how much is my foul play doing? Uh, even if your huge power max attack, my foul play doesn't break your sub. So I need to U-turn. Well, I'm going to try to roost. Thank goodness. If this is sub belly drum... We might be in a bit of a pickle. Yikes. Okay, so say that you're belly drum. Do I have anything for this? I mean, if so if you're sub belly drum though, I don't think that Aqua Jet kills me and now my foul play will break your sub. Yeah, because your leftovers, even if you're adamant, this shouldn't... Thank goodness. Doesn't kill. Okay. So your sub... Belly drum... Jet... What is that last move, though? I don't know if that's enough for another sub. But I'm going to foul play again anyway. I, I would rather just give this up. That's fine. Uh, okay, so now we send out Bulu. And, like, hope you're not Sap Zipper. <laughs> I don't think you'd be Belly Drum Sap Zipper. That, to me, that makes absolutely no sense. Um, let's see, Bulu. Azu, KO's Buzz. Yeah, so your Aqua Jet, I mean, it does a decent amount to me. But I'm just going to wood hammer here. I don't think there's a reason to save this. Huh? I was wrong. Magic. Okay. So the Slow King. Let's see if we can find out any more information about this. I should do like a third. Yeah. Okay. What is my answer into this thing now? Right, like I don't have a great answer anymore. Hmm. So we've got Azu, we've got Jolteon, Mamoswine, Slow King, Como. -O. I think. Might as well just use the eject pack here. We do, you know, like 10-ish percent. It's whatever. Not really anything, but it's a it's a free switch. Got to see if he was going to double. I, I, I don't think that it's going to help me with anything else. And I'll... If this is like a... Slack off... It's not, okay. So 107, 87, so 20, and it gets the poison. Not ideal, but uh, Sludge Bomb, 20. This is doing like, this might be no special attack, which I did not want to see. Um, if it's no special attack, I think it might actually be like max defense hmm yeah I'm just night shading again paput mammo 
big boy mammo. Okay, I can't get rocks away anymore. So, what that means... I, like, I really want to switch in Thunderous here, actually. It's not doing a whole lot anyway. This could be a bad move, but... Let's see. Ice Shard, if it's Life Orb... Yeah, you, you get up rocks. So, like, I wasn't going to be able to really switch in Thunderous again. This, this game is not looking great for me. Uh... I'm gonna Grass Knot, and then just attack until I die, basically. Uh, Ice Shard has a chance to not kill me, even if he's Life Orb, and since you're Rocks, I'm not sure that you're Life Orb. And he just withdraws. God dang it. Into the King again? Magic? Yeah. Yep. That's okay. Uh, we'll just Pulse until we die. This game is not going very well. The The freeze was not great, but I wasn't prepared for bulky Jolteon. <laughs> no more grass. Okay, I mean, that's good. Yeah, we'll, we'll just Dark Pulse here. I, I don't really see a good reason to do anything else. What do you switch to? Jolteon? Oh no, back to, back to this guy. Okay thinking I was going to Volt Switch. That's fine with me. That is amazing damage. Unfortunately, now I definitely die to Ice Shard. Doesn't even matter. Uh, there's no reason not to... I think Psychic's a better play if he switches. But you definitely have Ice Shard. Thinking about it though, so maybe he does not have Ice Shard. That that would be ideal because then either I get the kill on this or big damage on something else. But we are we are struggling. I'm I'm struggling to find an opportunity to get in Blaziken right now. Um just withdraws. Okay. Into magic again. That's fine. This might be the time. Yeah, I think I think this is the time. So Blaziken at plus two. Flare Blitz. Oh I might die to Flare Blitz recoil. Uh, what about Slowbro? Just isn't doing anything. I, I think, I think if I want to win this game, this is my last chance. I have to, uh, I have to sword stance right here. Oh, I didn't consider the crap. That's not good. I did not consider the rocks. Yeah, if you have Scald here, um. Stayed in. Oh, I mean, you probably have Psychic. I I mean, I think that was, yeah. The, my, my really only shot, I think, to break through this thing, though, was to just go for that right now. Um, or hope that you didn't have Psychic. Because how, how do I beat this now? You know, I can't. Just straight up. I, I have no other way to, to beat Slowking. Uh... Yeah, I mean the uh, the Mandibuzz thing was bad, but I I didn't really bring anything for this. If I'm being honest, like I I don't know what on my team could have really powered through it. I needed to bring a, a coverage move or something on Blaziken maybe, because uh, you know it gets. Flamethrower, so Ferrothorn was not the answer. It gets, uh, obviously, Sludge Bomb. And 
size shock, so like cryogonal wasn't the answer. Plus, it's really specially defensive, so cryogonal was not the answer. Uh, I kept thinking this whole time, like, how am I going to break through Gloking? And by by switching around the way that my opponent did, I mean, shout out to Sven. Uh, by switching around the way that he did with this and keeping this safe, it, it never really gave me an opportunity to do much of anything. So, I mean, we can we can do what we can to uh, to try to get differential here. Burn there would have been nice, so I could have gone for Scald again. Uh, World of Psychic. Yeah, it, like one of my first uh, iterations of this team had Calm Mind Slowbro to try to 1v1 the, the Slow King. Which would have been great, but uh, that doesn't help me when, you know, he's switching around like this, keeping it healthy. And to be fair, I had Galarian Slow King uh, in my last season of pack and won the championship with it. It was just an absolute monster. Psychic and Poison is such a great typing, and with Regenerator and the incredible stats that it has, like, there's not a whole lot you're going to be able to do. Uh, so the king, uh, KO'd Blaze, uh, Azu, KO'd by Bro, uh, Jolteon, indirect KO, okay, yeah, and, I mean, if this is Clangorous Soul, and it is, then yeah, I, I just lose here, that's alright. There was a, uh, let's see, how much damage am I even doing? Oh, I wasn't doing that much before the, the Soul Blaze. Oh, ooh, we almost got the, the knockout, though. That would have been cool. I think, I just to preserve differential, I think my best option is to sack Corsola here. Clanging scales. That should get him to plus two, right? If he's throat spray. Um, Como. Ooh, clanging scales disabled. Okay, it's not throat spray. Um, but at plus one, without being able to use clanging scales, like even boom burst doesn't kill me. So. We're in, a, we're in a pretty good spot here. And we can kill with Scald even at plus one spit up. Yeah, this should not kill me unless it crits. Amazing. It didn't even crit, really? Oh, it might be modest. How much health was I at? Yeah, okay, so it's about a 50% chance if it was modest. That's a bummer. You know, we uh, you do what you can. Is Baloo going to live this? If it's got Flamethrower, I absolutely die. Boom Burst. Uh, needs a max roll. We'll see. Uh, I guess we would hammer. I might just knock myself out. If it doesn't already kill me. Oh, but it's got Flamethrower. So that's going to be game. Uh, KO's Corsola, Bro, and Bulu at the end. So that is uh, an unfortunate 4-0 loss. GG's to Sven. Uh, I could not break through the bulky team. I was so worried about the setup mons and the offensive pressure that I didn't really plan for just a super bulky defensive team. Uh, really, really well played. We now have to win our last two games to uh, make playoffs. I think that we can do it, but obviously we're going to need some better teams than we showed out here today. So that's it, and I'll see you guys next week.